Hey guys, just Jenny. Quick tip, you can use your 22 shells for rivets. So here's some necklaces I did. You can see, makes a really nice rivet. Uh, so you do have to drill, if you use something like this, that comes pre-drilled, you do have to drill it bigger. So 22 shells are about a quarter of an inch drill bit. So you drill your holes, put them through, and just gonna use your side cutters. Cut them about a quarter of an inch from your piece. So, e, my best guess anyway, I don't actually measure it, about yay far. Okay, you see you've got these two little pinched bits. Um, now check the front. I mean, I kind of like mine right side up because, I don't know, I'm just like that. Um, but if you want them to not look too perfect or, get a hold here. Now's your last chance to turn them a little if you want it different. So uh, then I'm gonna hammer them. You can use one of these rubber pucks if you have one. I usually just use a piece of leather on my anvil just to keep it from getting marked up. And you're just gonna hammer that down. Now the reason I tapped in from both ends is you can see it's, it's very sharp. So you can either do that or you can take your side cutters and you can nip that little end off before you hammer it all the way down. It just depends. If you cut it like, like if it turned out too long and you have like a little bit too much brass sticking out, you can nip that off if you need to. So there's one. And there we go. And that's like really on there. It's not even wiggling. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe.